right guys this is to show you how to put in the trim after uh repairing the um the rollers for the uh, cup holder what you're gonna do is if you can see that lip it's a lip right here you want to create a ramp right above that lip just like that and then one on this side okay kind of have them spread apart like that and then what you do is you're going to take your trim kind of move the um gear shifter back to put it in now you put it in like this kind of get it angled up the right way and then once you get it about right here you're going to push on it and what's going to happen is it's going to slide up these cards and snap in i can't do it with one hand uh let's see if i can try to push on it One side's in. Alright, so I got it in. As you can see, it's level here and level on the side over here. Now, like I said, this ramp right here is this is the only way you're going to be able to get this to go in. Um, you can pull these out now. And then after that, you just snap everything in. Start snapping everything in. Make sure you got everything lined up right way. See? So all of that's snapped in. And then... I'm gonna have to take this a loose. All right, so this is loose, and I'm gonna take this new piece that I put vinyl on. Came out pretty good, and this I think this goes in from the top. No, 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 it goes in from the bottom. So you have to put this in underneath like this. Okay. And then you just snap it. There you go. So that's all snapped in. Now you got to plug it back up okay go back so now what you're gonna do is you're gonna line everything up it should just fall in and start snapping everything back down okay, everything snapped in I got everything snapped in. Close it back. And that's it. I know it was kind of shaky and hard to see, but I did get everything in. Um, I did repaint this. I sanded all of that uh that rubber um coating off of it. Then I think I did it with a 120 and then I went up to like a 800 or 400 and then an 800 and to get all the scratches off of it. And then I just, I just sprayed it, um, with a vinyl black, uh, flat black spray. So the part that's up here at the top, I suggest letting this dry for like a day or two. Um, the part that slides in up here and up there, it's always going to get scratched, but you can't see it. Like if you look up under here, 
you can't see it because it's 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 all the way up under there so you know so you don't have to worry about that and then you see how you can't see where I cut you can't see anything and then when you close this back it, it looks brand new all right guys I try my best to give you the best way to put this in. Um, I did put a link to another guy that does a very great job at it. Um, he's how I figured out how to get it in by watching his uh, YouTube. So you can check that out too if mine wasn't good enough. But um, this is J-O-A-T and I'm out.